Hello and welcome to my video where I'm going to be showing you how to write a blog post introduction paragraph. Even better, I'm actually going to show you how to create it and make AI write it for you, which is even better. I'm going to be using Jasper, so if you'd like to follow along, normally they don't advertise a free trial on their homepage, but if you check out the link down below and click that, you'll also get a very nice bonus to go along with it. Just to show you where I am in terms of in Jasper, if you click on blog right here, this little tab, once you're under templates, then you go to the blog post intro paragraph, and boom, here we are, let's get started. First and foremost, we're going to want the blog post title. What you're going to want to do is obviously have an idea of what you want to write about, obviously, right? You can't just write an intro when you're not sure what you're writing about. Would it make sense? So for this example, I'm going to say the benefits of using sales funnels for online marketers. Our audience is, is going to be marketers. You could add more like online business owners, uh, software users, uh, marketers, anything like that, affiliate marketers, network marketers, whatever it's going to be that's more geared towards your audience. But I'm going to go with broad with marketers. Tone of voice, I like witty matches my voice you can always change it up there's going to be plenty more which you can see here give me a sec if i scroll down like funny casual excited professional witty sarcastic feminine masculine bold dramatic grumpy secretive and a few others right there but let's go with that and our outputs are going to show up on the right once we click this blue button so let's generate that ai content and talk about what we get all right, so I still think it's amazing that we can enter in a blog post title and just get all this content generated for you i mean like think about all the software advancements that we've had and regardless of the software and what company it is i just still think it's so cool that you can do this maybe it's just me geeking over this stuff but we got a few of them here we got four this one's the longest notice it's going to cut off here a little which happens sometimes but let's talk about it and let's see what we get we all know that when it comes to selling anything whether it's a product or a service a well-executed sales funnel is key but what are the benefits of using sales funnels for online marketers? Well, let's take a look at some of the most important ones. First and foremost, sales funnels allow you to easily track your leads and potential customers as they move through your marketing funnel. Secondly, they help you to better segment your audience so that you can target them more effectively with your marketing messages. Finally, sales funnels automate much of the lead generation and follow-up process, making it easier for you to convert more leads into customers. So if you're not currently using sales funnels in your online marketing efforts, now is you can just put the time. Like I said, this happens sometimes. It'll just leave out a few words, but it was easy to do like now is the time or like keep reading on as we talk about more of the benefits. That was a fabulous introduction. My goodness, that was a lot of context. It was great. It dove into some benefits in terms of why you want to use them. And then, of course, from there on, like if you want to write that full article, you could do the outline, talk more about those in deeper detail, or just go to different benefits, you know, when it comes to using uh, sales funnels for online marketers. That one was really good. Let's go to the next one. Are you looking for ways to improve your online marketing? If so, you should definitely consider using sales funnels. Funnels can help you to more effectively target and convert your audience, resulting in better ROI. In this post, we'll take a closer look at the benefits of using sales funnels for online marketers. Stay tuned, or keep reading on, or let's begin, or let's dive right into it. Once again, very good. That was a little shorter one, but I liked how it talks about like an introduction. In this article, we're going to be going over this, 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 and this. You hear that or see that in videos a lot too. Like in this video, you're going to learn this, you're going to see this, you're going to learn about this, make sure you read to the end, and so on and so forth. Let's go to the third one right here. Sales funnels are an invaluable tool for online marketers. By using sales funnels, you can create a system that steadily converts leads into customers and increases your revenue. In this blog post, we'll discuss the benefits of using sales funnels for online marketers and provide tips on how to create a successful sales funnel for your business. So let's get started. Once again, very good. That was a shorter one and it talks more about what you're going to see as you keep reading on, but it also talks about what they can do in terms of a benefit here. So that one was like a mix and match. You get one longer sentence in terms of the benefits, how it's going to help you. And then more so like in this blog post, if you keep reading on, you're going to learn about this, 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 and this. And last but not least. If there's one thing that all online marketers can agree on, it's that sales funnels are essential for success. But what are sales funnels and why are they so important? In this blog post, we'll discuss the benefits of using sales funnels for online marketing and how they can help you achieve your business goals. Stay tuned to learn more. All right, so it really likes to stay tuned. Like, I don't think I've ever written that. I'm probably like, be sure to keep reading on or let's get right into it or let's get started. But just a way of saying it, obviously. But overall, these were really good. Aside from this, where it said like, now is the time. You know, there's like two words that I missed. These were fantastic examples when it comes to blog post intros. I don't know about you, but a lot of times I leave my intros just so straight to the point, which isn't a bad thing. It's more about, let's just say like I was reviewing product XYZ. 
and be like, hey, thanks for checking out my product XYZ review. I'm not big on introduction, so let's get right into it. Literally, like a lot of times I'll just do that because I'll put something down in the intro and then move past it. So this is a feature I really like because it allows me to kind of burst through one of the weak points in my blog writing. But obviously that's going to be different for anyone. And with Jasper, you can pretty much just use it to create all the aspects, whether it's the intro, the conclusion, the middle, the outline, and of course, doing the entire thing with their long form writer or paragraph generator. That's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, if you want to test them out, they do have the link down below in the description for a free trial and you get a nice bonus so you can actually test out Jasper just like I did to make sure you like it and it's going to be perfect for you and your online business. That's about it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.